as a means of countering the unemployment challenge, government has initiated a number of programs and policies. Many schools are now embracing the social entrepreneurship project and are coming up with paper products, beads, art and craft, soap making and agriculture. Such skills are much needed to reduce the unemployment challenges. Promoting entrepreneurship is relevant to the students, especially uh, the school-going children, because they are learning how to teach. And so after school, after the six years, the four years, even, even when somebody in senior one, in senior two, senior three, they are able to make business. Nwagaba Adela is a social entrepreneur trainer at St. Andrew Gombe High School, Kawala. She's happy that most of the students in her class are now able to survive on such skills. And these people, the students, go out and look for market by themselves. They go out, they sell them off, they have learned leadership skills, they can communicate to people, they can interview them. Youth here have no worry for market. They have partnered with sister schools in India where they get orders through social media platforms. For us we have a market whereby we have a partner school from India, it's called Sai International School. We do sell our commodities, the products we produce, we export them. The students here have formed a global company and many of them are buying shares. Each share goes for 5,000 Uganda shillings. It is going to help me because even me, I'm planning to have to be a businessman. So, in addition to what I will gain more, it is the business skills. We are in the in the company. We are doing art and crafts. We have the earrings, and we have we, we have the bangles. We make the African bags. Yes, I'm going to get the money. I can start my own business, I can acquire the money without going to men, without going to men and raise myself to acquire money for small things, but I can buy, I can get the money through the shares that I have from the company and I can buy small things that make it, uh, we girls to go through those men. Ah, this thing, it, it is going to help me because even me, I'm planning to have to be a businessman. So in addition to what I will gain more, it is the business skills where I will apply where necessary to gain more or to resist a lot of. St. Andrew Gombe High School Kawala is one of the schools which has benefited from Teach a Man to Fish Global Initiative, where many teachers and students have been trained vocational and entrepreneurship skills. I can make bangles. Uh, we have this type of bang, but I can make another type of bangle using paper, paper, papers. I can make beads and do bangles plus the necklaces and bags. Additionally, these students have gained skills in public speaking and this is helping many to take up leadership positions in schools. I have been able to learn communication skills. I can communicate without fear. Before was, I was fearing people, but now I can communicate without fear. Another thing. I gained confidence because before even I had joined it, I had no self-esteem, but right now I can talk to the public. Alongside being marketeers, Douglas Setumba compiled this report.